Let us start our activity. Look to this picture and try to answer the following questions. How do you know that prayer time has come? And how does Imam gather worshippers to perform a prayer? We can know time of prayer through Google site. I can search on internet about in Google about the time of prayers so I can know through app. If I have application on my phone, I can search on it about the times of prayers. The third, through calendar. If I have this calendar for the years, days, it shows the times of prayers so I can know. The force through hearing a then. If I hear the then prayer through most, I can know that uh, this time of prayer, but also with that, I should know prayer's times so I can identify exactly which prayer for that and then. Now you can guess the title of our lesson. Yes, our lesson today about the call to prayer and then and the second call to prayer Iqama. Do you know what does it mean, Adhan and the Iqama? Follow our lesson, you will know more about Adhan and the Iqama and also about prayer. This is a Zen word is Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Ashhadu Allah Ilaha illallah Ashhadu an la ilaha illallah Ashhadu anna Muhammadar Rasulullah أشهد أن محمد رسول الله حي على الصلاة حي على الصلاة حي على الفلاح حي على الفلاح الله أكبر الله أكبر لا لا إله إلا الله. Give a challenge question. Which words we added it only on at the end of Fajr prayer? 
do you know thing yeah we added only in Adhan of Fajr prayer this word this As-Salatu Khayrun Min Al-Nawm Haftar Hayya Al Al-Falah We should say As-Salatu Khayrun Min Al-Nawm This is the Muazzin should say this word this after saying Hayya Al Al-Falah and this only on Fajr prayer. Do you know why? Think. Yeah, to encourage Muslims to come to mosque to pray Fajr prayer. I have here also a creative question. Do you know the dua that we should say between Adan and the comma? Think or search. Yeah. The dua that the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam learned us to do and say between Adan and the Iqama this dua. Allahumma rabba hadhi da'wat al-tam wa salat al-qa'ima ati Muhammadin al-wasila wa al-fadila wa ba'athhum maqaman mahmudan al-lazhi wa'atta innaka la tukhlifu al-mi'ad and there is hadith in this Matar, the Prophet narrated Anas ibn Malik radiallahu an that the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said the supplication made between the Adan and the Iqama is not rejected. Sunan Abu Dawood, this hadith means that the dua is not rejected means we can say in a dua between Adan and the Iqama and also it will be acceptable from Allah glory be to him Allah will accept this dua and we learn after that in another lesson about there are times that dua is acceptable in these times one of these times is the time between Adhan and Iqama so we should keen on say this dua may Allah help me and you to say this dua and accept our dua After Adhan and before Iqama, there is a waiting time between Adhan and Iqama. Do you know how long this time? It is 15 minutes at the whole prayers except Maghrib prayer. It is only 5 minutes. Do you know why? why the muslim scholars they made this waiting time between adhan and the comma yeah in order to more people come to mosque to do prayer at mosque maybe some people are living away from the mosque or busy or need to take more time through do and come to masjid to do prayer so made this time waiting time between Adan and the comma in order to let more people more Muslims come to mosque to do prayer at mosque 
because the, the prayer at mosque is better than in the world. The individual prayer, if we pray alone, do you know how many hasanat we will get more if we pray jama'ah at mosque? Yeah, 27 hasanat. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Salat al Jama'ah Afdal min Salat al Fadz bi 27 daraja. Congregational prayer or Jama'ah prayer is better than by 27 hasanat, individual prayer or lonely prayer. And I have here a challenge question also. Why only between after Maghrib then only waiting the time is five minutes only? Do you know why? Think. Yeah, because no more time between Maghrib prayer and the Isha prayer. It is only maybe around one hour so if we wait for 15 minutes and pray in 5 or 10 minutes like this it will be hard for Muslims to didn't follow their works or maybe someone need to do something between Maghrib and Deja so they made only five minutes between the waiting time, only five minutes between Maghrib prayer and Isha prayer. After that, the Muslims standing up and the Muazzin or Imam say words of Iqama. Do you know the words of Iqama? And these are a comma worries. Allah Akbar Allah Akbar Ashadu Allah Ilaha Illallah Ashadu Anna Muhammad Rasulullah Hayya ala al-salah Hayya ala al-falah Qad iqamati al-salat Qad iqamati al-salat Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar La ilaha These some activities about the lesson. This watch this video to find out the meaning of the words of Adhan. And this activity to remember. I was a then of Fajr prayer is different the other adhans. This activity to compare between Adan and the Ikana. This strategy called the similarities and the differentiation. Try to find out the similarities and differentiation between Adhan and the Iqama.
and this activity to arrange the words of Aden in order 